Dynamics GP 2013 R2 includes new functionality to allow you to roll back the fiscal year-end close in the general ledger. This is pretty handy. If you make a mistake, you need to go back and change things. This allows you to do it real easily, and it's easy to do. So let me show it to you. In my current system, I've closed 2014. So all the balance sheet numbers have been rolled forward to 2015. So let me print a trial balance so we can see that here. So here's my trial balance. You can see the beginning balance for 2015 includes the result of the year and close for 2014. Now let's go back in, reverse that close, and see what happens. It's really quite easy to do. You just go to the regular year and closing in the financial area page here. And you'll notice that there's a new button called reverse historical year. So I'm going to reverse a historical year. And 2014 is the most recent historical year. So I'm going to process that. At the end of the process, there's a recommendation to reconcile all open years. And now you can see in the year and closing routine, the next year to close is 2014, not 2015. So let's take a look at the trial balance for 2015. And we can see that the opening balances for 2015 have all been rolled back. So now 2014 is now an open ledger year. You can go and create transactions in the year and then post them. Then if you want to, you can close that year out again. And I found out that you can close historical years that were closed in versions of GP prior to 2013 R2. So this is going to be pretty handy. You may want to use it from time to time, and it's really easy to do.